终于靠岸，太平洋温度的全面。我甘愿沦为沧海一粟的平凡，却只是今晚。You tell me not to think too much， 这主观臆断。What's good, guys? It's Shana J, and I'm back with another video. So today, I wanted to bring you guys the third wig in my red series that I was doing. So I gave you guys the Yara Bang wig, and I gave you guys the curly ombre, um, big red hair. And now I wanted to give you guys something like way different for me because I always wanted to try to cut my hair, but then. <laughs> What had happened was I watched some videos of like different short wigs or different like whatever kind of cut wigs and I was like yeah I could get one of those ones that's like real close to my head and I'm gonna look so cute and I'm gonna look like a baddie. Well sis, can we just talk about it for a second? Let me just, let me just, let me just. So I already like lost the front part so I will insert a picture somewhere over here of what it actually looks like so you know which one not to get unless you're trying to look like somebody's auntie so this is the Haley wig and it's a shake and go from snghair.com and it's a free trust equal wig <laughs> uh, like are you even ready like are you sure you're even ready because I certainly was not was not ready when I opened it so I'm just gonna cut to the chase with this one and try to put it on. I'm not even gonna, right now my hair is in a bun like this, but I'm just gonna put it in two braids and then try to flip them up and then sh basically shove them under, um, just under the wig because I'm not gonna put a wig cap on or do any of that extra stuff. I just wanna put it on and see how it goes. So we're gonna just, I'm gonna try to use the mirror that's back there, so don't mind me. And I might speed this up because it was a struggle to put it on. I couldn't even, here, I'll show you guys up close before I put it on. Looking very wiggy, looking very auntie E. Like the lady in front of you in church that wears the big hat and like slaps you with a spatula if you act up. This is the front, I think. No part, no definition, no rhyme or reason of what's supposed to be going on in your head. <sighs> We're just gonna put it on. just get it together because <laughs> oh my god bruh I facetimed Gabe when I first tried this on and I had no makeup on or anything and he literally starts roasting me and was like yo why do you look like your name should be Milton like just roasting me and I was like he's not even wrong like where did I go wrong with this wig is it entertaining that I'm uh, doing my little braids with it on my head like this? Do you like that? can see I'm pretty much struggling but we're trying to make it happen it doesn't look absolutely terrible but like just the struggle of getting it on and just that I assumed it was gonna be a little bit longer at least on the top than it is it just <sighs> oh and while I'm adjusting this are you guys happy now I turned my fish tank off so I don't have to get any comments of what's that trickling in the background do you have your faucet on no I don't have my faucet on okay so like <sighs> I don't absolutely hate it, I only like slightly somewhat hate it. And it's only because maybe if I had shorter hair or if I knew how to cornrow, this would be working out a little bit better. Um, but the only thing that I'm not a fan of is that the sideburns don't go down far enough to cover like my actual hair. And it's not even because my hair is too puffy because this part is flat, so at least this part should be covered and you can still see the black of my hair like underneath. This I tried to like bump it with um, a straightener and that didn't work because there's literally like not even enough hair to try to bump it or do anything with it. Um, 
I don't know. I don't know. It's not terrible. It feels good. It's just I have too much hair under there, I think. If I had a buzz cut or something, maybe it would work out a little bit better. And it's not a terrible color. I love the color. It's just that there's, it doesn't look natural at all and I don't really know what to do about that because there's nothing to work with, you know what I mean? But I will show you guys what it looks like in the back. <laughs> look at this, like what's happening, bro? Guys, it's not even terrible. I need to just get over it and just get used to seeing myself with it on. Maybe like put my hair a little flatter because after I played with it a little, it's something doable. I don't know if I look like a punk rock, like 90s chick, or if I look like someone's like angry mom who's about to call the manager or like get crazy in the grocery store. Uh. So my overall impressions of this wig are, I love the color. It's soft and smooth. I don't think there's many style options. You can't really do anything with it because it is so short. And even the parts that are long enough to grab, if you try to curl them or bump them or do anything, they kind of just stay flat. They don't really do anything. Um, it is nice and secure on my head. It's not going to go anywhere, obviously. The color looks nice on my skin, so that's a plus. But I do have, I don't know, like low sideburns maybe. And this does not cover it well. I guess if I gel it back better, it'll be okay. The back doesn't look terrible, but it could use some, like, some type of trim or something like that because it's a weird shape. Um, and there's not really enough bang to make any style or like shape your face in a certain way. I think if you're gonna wear this wig, you just gotta wear it confidently and like, even if you don't like it that much, if you plan on wearing it, just pretend like you love it and it's the best thing that's ever happened to you because if I give you a little bit of attitude and I hit you with a little angle, then. Smize, smize, yes. I got this wig off of Sam's Beauty and I believe it was only $19.99 um, but I'll put the link in the description as I always do so for the amount of money that it was if you do like this style I got you but if you wanted something for every day that could shape your face and really look like um, or like be, be customizable or something that you can make more like yourself this is not it because you literally can't do anything with it um, I don't hate it so I will be taking some more pictures with it and hitting you with these angles and all this and all Thank you guys so much for watching and supporting my videos i've gotten a few dms and a few like story reposts from people on instagram and i don't know if that sounds corny but that was hyping me up and that made me really excited so shout out to anybody who's been supporting me for the from the beginning or posted me on their story or told anyone any one of your friends or family to go watch my videos it really means a lot to me i do try to put out good content for you guys just leave some notes down in the comment section of what you guys would want to see and i will try out any wigs you guys want me to try out under 100 dollars make sure to hit the like button and the subscribe button and don't forget to follow me on Instagram at it's Shana J. And I will see you guys in my next one.